everybody welcome back to my channel it's chloe and in this video i'm going to show you guys how i got this look using the camille rose lavender collection on my hair and what i think about the products Closing up shop cause you're all in my head and I mean it a lot cause you're the one I need yeah. Wait, 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 hold up, hold up You're the one I need This is my fourth verse about you verse, You're right. getting sick and tired, baby, so am I Wish I could forget you I can't forget you live in my mind, you ain't paying rent Never sweep, never clean, never mean What you wanna mean, always make a scene Don't wanna be seen, girl, you made a mess of me What's the recipe? Boy, you gotta chill Two scoops on the cone You feel like a summer day Hot pavement, no wasting time Cause we gotta play Yeah, we're in our 20s, but we still children On the cloud, higher than the buildings That's the skyline, don't look down now You'll be just fine on this cloud nine That's for sure Hopping on the cloud I'm so far up, I don't plan on coming down. Baby, pull up, show me what you're trying to do. What you wanna do? What you wanna do? everything I just used. So the Lavender Fresh Cleanse um, Detangling and Moisturizing Hair Cleanser. Honestly, I actually really enjoyed this. The only thing about this was it was a smell. It says um, our detangling and moisturizing hair cleanser blends clarifying apple cider extract. So it might be the apple cider that's really giving it the strong smell. But um, overall, I think it was a great cleanser. My hair felt really clean using it. It, um, it kind of did dry out my hair afterwards. So it did have, you know, that drying shampoo effect that we mostly get with most shampoo. But if you do want to try it, I do recommend it. I liked it. So um, as rating, I'd probably give this a 4.4 out of 5 stars. So, uh, the next product I used was the Lavender Quench Deep Conditioner. Um, it is the moisturizing hair mask, and honestly, I really like this deep conditioner. It slipped through my hair really well. Um, 
I felt like after I left it in my hair, my hair felt super moisturized. It smells amazing. It, it smells really good. Oh, I love it. I touched my lip. Yeah, I really like this deep conditioner. So I would give it probably a 4.8 stars. Only because it's in such a little jar. And I hate when deep conditioners are in such a little jars. Because I feel like I'm going to go through them really quickly. But um, yeah, 4.8. One thing I can say about this line that is really good is that on the label it says that they are free of parabens and sulfates. If you can see that or not. But this little green sticker says that it is free of parabens and sulfates. So. So the next product I used was the Whipped Cream Leave-In, the Intense Moisturizing Leave-In Cream. Um, the thing about this product, it was thick, like a cream. Um, it was kind of hard to squeeze out. I was really struggling with it. But um, it was moisturizing. It, I don't think it had intense moisturizing properties because it didn't easily slip through my hair like I thought it would, but it it did its job. You know, it did moisturize my hair. Um, I wouldn't recommend this for detangling, but it's pretty good. If I gave it a rating, oh, hold on, the smell. Yeah, and it smells really good. The smell, the smell similar to the um, deep conditioner, so. Um, if I would give this a rating, I would give the whipped cream leave-in probably a 4.5. Last but not least, um, the Crush Defining Gel. Honestly, guys, I really think this is going to be my new favorite hair gel. Because as soon as I put this in my hair, it slipped through my hair so... It, it just felt so heavenly <laughs> in my hair. It felt so soft. It didn't feel like an, like an annoyingly sticky gel. It slipped through my hair. It... Um, it just felt so good. I don't know. And because the leave-in conditioner didn't have as much slip, this gave, this definitely gave the slip my hair needed for my fingers to just go through my hair strands and distribute the product very evenly. It felt really great. And the smell of this, it also smells good. It also smells really good. It says it's lavender infused hair gel crafted for definition and extra hold. And my curls do look very defined and it is holding. So <laughs> it's doing its job. But um, I think I would give this a four, not even, like five stars. Five stars. I definitely recommend this hair gel. And I really put in a lot. Of this product in my hair and it doesn't even feel crunchy it feels so good and i know camille rose they have um another defining gel they're camille rose naturals in that collection um damn i should go get it i have the curl maker here and the crush defining gel and in my opinion so it's kind of hard because they are both really great gel. I can't decide which one's better. Even though this one does, it feels a little more sticky than this one. And this one, but they both slip through your hair really well. I don't know. But these two are my favorite defining gels and I highly recommend them both. Alright, so that's it on my tutorial and review of the Camille Rose Lavender Collection. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Anything is appreciated. And tune in for my next video, which should be out fairly soon. Alright guys, I'll see you later. Bye!